Hey YouTube, wanted to say Happy New Year to you. And um, I wanted to do a quick video and talk a little bit about um, my hair. So um, if you watched any of my older videos, you would see that I have longer hair. Um, I've had long hair, I've had shorter, shorter, a little bit to here. And September 11th, 2009, I did the big chop. And my hair was extremely short. I did do it all the way, um, just went after it. And it's grown out so much. And today, I'm actually going to um, color it. I'm going to use some moisturizing color. And I'm going to twist it up. So um, here's my hair. You can see there. Um, I don't have anything in it. I don't put a texturizer or nothing. This is my natural um, sort of curl pattern. And I'm excited about it. The reason I did the big chop is my boyfriend actually suggested it. He said, have you ever thought about you know, chopping off all your hair, and I was like, no, Ugh, are you kidding me? I've had a perm since I was 18, I've had beautiful hair, and um, I'm not, you know, I've never really worn the weaves, I kind of like worn some of the ponytails, I was like, no way, but he just kind of said, okay, and the more I thought about it, he actually sent me some YouTube videos from BJB Productions, and talked to me a little bit more about it, how beautiful he thought I would be, and how becoming, and how strong I was already, and just, he said it would, it would be a journey. So one day, I just kept thinking about it more and more, did a lot of research and said, why am I so stuck up on this firm? You know, I work in a corporate career. I have another business organization I run, but my hair doesn't define me. And so one day I told him, I said, I'm gonna go do it. A few weeks later, I called him up and I said, I think I'm gonna do it. So he called me and said, did you do it? And I'm like, no. So when he saw me later that day, he's like, oh my God, you did it. And he just was so happy, so supportive. And um, this is the result. So this is after uh, it's been three months now, since September 11th, I cut it, 2009. I'm very pleased. You see the back. I don't know how it really looks back there, but um, I just woke up. So. <laughs> um, yeah, this is how it looks. So this is how it looks. I'm hoping that the color will come out great, semi-permanent. Um, this is amethyst. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm hoping that'll be great. And I realized I really need some shea butter. So I'm gonna use some coconut. Um, I'm gonna use some shea butter mix. I'm gonna use some vegetable glycerin, a um, bunch of stuff. I'll make a quick video about that. And I'm gonna wash my hair first. I'm gonna do the color. I'm gonna go whip up the stuff. And then I'm gonna twist it up. And then I'm gonna come back and hopefully it'll be something really, really great. So I just wanna encourage you, if you thought about the Big Chop, do it. It has been liberating. It has been awesome. There is not one day this has gone by that someone has not said, I love your hair. You have a cute face. Um, your hair is beautiful. What do you have in it? And oh my goodness, I just love your look. You can do a lot of things with it. Um, I'm now to a point where I can wear a headband. Yay. Um, I put a little part sometimes in it. Um, you can put a cute little flower. Put a flower in it. And I'm actually going to do a tutorial. I found out a way to use make a flower and actually use a clip or a headband um, and some glue, you use a little clip. I saw a girl do it. So, you know, there's a lot of ways that I, I just love having natural hair. It is so empowering. Just being free and you can focus more on your makeup if you want or your natural beautiful face and your skin. Um, I love it. So if you've ever thought about going natural, do it. Uh, it's just so freeing. So I need to make an actual video. So I'm going to ask him in the next few months to make that video. I, I just don't have time for all those edits. Um, but I hope that you're having an awesome start to your new year. Like I said, I'm going to go off and do these things. I'm going to upload this, and then I'm going to kind of do some how-tos on, you know, how I'm coloring it um, and how I make the whip shade better for my hair because I don't like to make videos too long. All right. Well, hey, make today great. Make your life great day by day. If you're a single parent, Please think about joining my organization, Nonprofit for Single Parents. We are next year, or this year, 2010, um, looking to fund the $1,000 emergency fund for a minimum of 10 single parents. So I'm looking for members, so you have to be a member of the organization. Details are at the website, which is below. All right. Thanks again. And if you know a single parent, please pass them. The unwed, divorced, married, and separated, widowed, please. We need your support, especially in 2010. And um, hey, thanks. Thanks for watching. Rate, comment, and subscribe so you can get all the updates.